session uh, you you've seen the uh, what we call the, the institution building part the financial inclusion and just before we left for lunch you also saw through this movement how we could also find solutions for agriculture then we have half an hour plenary then we split into groups uh, in addition to what you have heard so far, one uh, very important intervention with these women are taken are the gender interventions, issues of domestic violence, girl-child marriages, the intra-family equity related issues. So Dhanama, who is the... Dharma is from Andhra Pradesh. Uh, this gender intervention also happens through a community-based strategy. When we started the gender intervention in Andhra Pradesh in 2001-2, again, one of the mistakes that we made, we first thought we'll get some good lawyers, good academicians, good professors. So we made all of them into gender resource groups. But uh, professor ko samay mila to kisi aur ko samay nahi mila to they were not uh, effective. Then we changed the strategy saying that uh, women who have gone through this crisis themselves have emerged victorious and are interested in taking this forward. So what we call as the gender resource persons or the social action committees. So this methodology, uh, we changed the methodology and they themselves lead this uh, battle. They undergo some orientation on the legal aspects. But uh, the entire uh, thrust comes from their own experience and the kind of determination they have that uh, this should not befall others. That commitment cannot come from anyone other than themselves. <coughs> The social action committee is present in every village where uh, it's a 10 member committee at the village level who ensure that these issues are discussed in the self-help group <coughs> meetings and wherever there are some actionable issues they take it up, they try to resolve the issue themselves. Sometimes if it can't be done by them then they take the help of police. You'll be very surprised to know that uh, many districts police cooperate with them. And as I mentioned, Dhanama can ring up the SP any time. And he responds also. And there's a lady, Adishti SP. So she's another person who constantly responds whenever Dhanama rings up. So this kind of an alliance that they form, they formed alliance with the district judge, so with the judiciary. So this is, somebody was talking about convergence. So these are kind of things that emerge through working on these issues. They don't happen automatically. So I'd like Dhanama to talk about her uh, uh, work and what they have achieved. Since she can't speak in uh, Hindi, I'll have to do the translation. Andarki Namaskara, Na Peru Dhanamma. Mari Nangundi Dilla, Deva Kondamandala, Marandra Pradesh, then Gender Action Kamtila, Vendivay Lavonosuji, She is from Nalgunda, she is in the Gender Action Committee from year 2003. Nino Ka Peda Kutumam in Chachano, in Sangamu Tere in Taravata, E. Pari Mutala Vishalalo. Gadaval Dergay Kira, Elam Tinduimone, Anukuni Rami, Mapu, Counseling Jesi, Navarta, 
she herself was a victim of domestic violence. She uh, got support from the group and uh, she was able to overcome that uh, crisis. Uh, then she says uh, in their district, this Nalgonda district, they have solved Nalgonda. So 4,500 cases. See, see, poor people don't get justice. Justice uh, delayed is denied, that's also there, but they don't get justice at all. This is something justice at their doorstep through a mechanism which they value. So they have prevented 25 uh, girl-child marriages uh, then she says uh, 76 girl children who were abandoned by their parents or we all know. There is a <laughs> see if we can't since we can't resolve the issue we have a scheme for that. So it says that oh you you are if you want to abandon your child fine abandon it in front of our office. So there is that some lali or ladli or some scheme. So these girls. So the government says, I can't stop you from abandoning your girls, but abandon in front of my office. So she says 76 girls who are abandoned like that were returned to their parents after they counseled their parents. I asked them, why do they listen to you? So, she was saying that they tried to convince them, but in case the parents are so adamant, because they, they are worried that they may kill the child. So, then they say in such a case, then we uh, hand them over to the ICDS. <coughs> You just create one case study. Memo, their network is basically 10 women in every village who are focused on the gender interventions. They are called the social action committee and from among them they pick up the more experienced ones. So there is a 10 member committee at the Mandal level, that is the sub block level. Mandal has uh, typically 25 uh, Gram Panchayats. So, and then they have, uh, as I said, good relations with the police. 
किशोर बालकल को ट्रेनिंग में बढ़ाओ किशोर बालकल के सुलो अलांटी भी जर्जी की कोर्ट को अच्छी ना होना माँ कामस्लिंग वाले को वालों पक्षपता ये बिल्ला लाई के संगावटी मंच का डील जाए अली बिल कंपलसरी आर बिल्ला लगावटी मेरा आलम सपोर्ट का उन्हें वाले की के सुपाइड की रात उन्हें डील जाए अली जर्जी लोग पर जब पिने के she was mentioning how adolescent girls, if they face harassment from the schools or colleges, so those cases go to the district judge. And the district judge refers those cases to them to handle those cases. Has success of the year? Sarlak Sikshe Inchar. Sarlak Sikshe Inchar. Yes. What do you mean? One of the people in the school is the school. 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 This is a case where they found a hostel warden was uh, molesting girls and uh, she just mentioned that uh, they ensured that you know, he was arrested and uh, they are working towards his conviction. <coughs> she was mentioning that this uh, gender intervention is not limited only to the self-help group members. So she says any, uh, you know, what she says, uh, educated, employed uh, uh, and government servants, their spouses also, they come to them for uh, solving these cases. And they said that we've been able to resolve those issues. I think recently they got some punishment for a DYSP in Krishna district who had deserted his wife. So all these people went <laughs> there. Ensure that there was a punishment there. And Guru Matsamo, Rashtra Mantra, any case to such kind of thing, I can tell you all. So she says more than 200,000 cases have been. Uh, taken up at the state level and uh, actually the pioneering districts here were the four districts of Krishna, Vaishnadavri, Guntur and Prakasham districts and uh, that provided us the inspiration to take this to the entire state. So the point in this intervention is now you may say what's the connection with poverty but unless there is intra-family equity you can't say that you're out of poverty. So this is a very important intervention very sensitive intervention and requires a lot of courage. I have seen uh, uh, women who had gone to some villages, which are very notorious uh, faction-ridden uh, villages, and they went to the police station. They said, the police asked them, why did you come here? They said, uh, you know, there is a problem here, there is a problem there, we have come. That <laughs> side told them, you please go back, don't stay here, you will get killed. They said, no, we have come here to help our sister, we will not go. And they stayed there, solved the case and then uh, went back. So it requires a lot of courage. They have pursued people who were involved in trafficking. They worked with uh, traffic survivors. 
So it requires a lot of sensitivity, guts, and uh, you know, willingness to travel anywhere. Uh, middle of the night, if there's some problem, they'll, they'll not hesitate, they'll just go because there is some life at stake. Okay, so that's పడుకునేవాళ్ళము ఏం చేయలేమంటే మేము మా ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ నుంచి ప్రకాశం జిల్లా పోలీస్ స్టేషన్ కి ఫోన్ చేసి అక్కడ పోలీస్ వాళ్ళ నెంబర్లు తీసుకుని మేము ఐదుగురు మహిళలు అక్కడికి ప్రకాశం జిల్లా వెళ్ళిపోయి అతను ఉన్న ఊరికి వెళ్ళి వాళ్ళ అమ్మ నాన్నతో వాళ్ళతో మాట్లాడి వాళ్ళు ఏం లేని పేదవాళ్ళు వాళ్ళకి నాలుగురు ఆడపిల్లలు ఉన్నారు మీ అబ్బాయి ఇలా మోసం చేసి వచ్చారు ఆ అమ్మాయికి ఐదో నెల రావడం వల్ల ఇప్పుడు ఆ అమ్మాయిని ఏమి చేయాలో తెలియని పరిస్థితిలో ఉంది మీ అబ్బాయి ఇలా చేస్తానని మేము చెప్పి ఆ తల్లిదండ్రులని వాళ్ళందరినీ కూడా అక్కడికి మన ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ మళ్ళీ ఒక ఇరవై వేలు లోన్ లాగా ఇచ్చి మేమందరము ఆ తల్లిలాగా అయ్యి అందరం తలా కొన్ని డబ్బులు ఇచ్చి వాళ్ళకి చీర తీసి ఆ కుటుంబాన్ని నిలబెట్టాము ఇప్పుడు ఇద్దరు బాబులు వాళ్ళు చాలా యాభై ఉన్నారు మన కలెక్టర్ ప్రకాశం డిస్ట్రిక్ట్ దెన్ she was pregnant by him then he deserted her went back to his district the complaint came went to them so they went to the police the police said what can we do he is not from our district so we can't pursue the case so these people they rang up the police station in prakasham district rang up the social action committee there they went to not very far but about 100 150 200 kilometers went there council the parents and also council the the groups there <coughs> brought the boy and the parents to this village and uh, they said that look the marriage will happen at 18 years age so that was the agreement that they should get married when she becomes 18 till that time they'll take care of the child and uh, she says after they were 18 they got her married to him and uh, the family is fine now they also provide about 20000 rupees support to that couple from their own funds this is an unbelievable tale and they constantly humble us time there no this is very difficult because the time doesn't wait for anybody uh yeah this is a very difficult intervention it's not easy and uh, you have so many shows on television discussing these issues but these are people who are actually tackling these issues but the state as a whole oh this is a certificate she got from nalgonda sp on the international uh, women's day so this is certificate that the sp has given her we phone ettar hai na we phone chestu kala ha eppudaina ha i asked her does the sp respond to your phone he says yes he has told my name in his uh, phone so whenever i ring up he always responds if i ask drama how are you and then he tackles our cases so i think just taking the cue from danama and what tajipisa told you in the morning 
that's the kind of support they require. They have the courage, but if people like you, people like us, support them, then there is no you know, hurdles they can't cross. Uh, so I just wanted to tell you what this simple institution of women can do as we work with them, build capacities, <clears throat> and there are at least uh, 15, 16 major interventions in Andhra Pradesh, 12, 13 major interventions in Kerala, similar interventions in Tamil Nadu. So as uh, this movement matures, these kind of interventions will multiply. I, I want uh, one more, uh, uh, Sudha Ratna, uh, she is our health uh, community resource person. Randu. She is a health community resource person. In that brief bio sketch you will read, she had a personal tragedy where she lost her son because she couldn't get him the right medicines. My name is Sudharatna, from Andhra Pradesh. My district name is Chittur. My mother name is Tambalapalli. My village name is Uplur Vandapalli. Oh. I don't have a problem with that. Auntie, I don't have a problem with that, sir. Auntie, if you want to... Auntie, if you want to... माँ को लेकर अपने लोग बैंग बुड़ा है चाला पैदरी को मिल चुका हूँ अंटे संगम लाइक रात मुंडे पारसी तो अंटे मामा वालों को मैं मुकुर आड़ पिला लाना था अपने ऐसे नहीं आता अंटे आड़ पिला लोग बोलते हैं ना इंटरनल जी पिन तो अंदर के वंपी चैनल वाले ना नहीं थी वो का नाम बोलते हैं अंते आप उन्हों पहले जैसे तरवाता वाने एक बा बाव मुट्टे डो अंते बिल्लर पुटना अंते अलेलाड क्या करते हैं जिसको अलग ले दो आ हेल्थ गुरिंच कारी मायावर जिस गुरिंच कारी मावेट्टी ना तंग कारी अंते ये दे चले दिन का मैं इंटलो पैरिगी तो गुड़ा बाग पैदरी तुम लोग अगर कामों पानी कूल uh, unaware of what are the precautions to be taken as a as a mother or, or as when I was pregnant, how to take care of my health, my child's health. So I was completely ignorant of all this. Ante apne mein baav puttin tarata government hospital lone dela rehni. Kani puttin tarata mano lenge pavali pesa lo muri baal bata do muri baal bata pinte kema hoti. Ante pesa avani pinte baal mein mana rehni baav ma baby mar mein bata lo chhap panch dar nee lo. So she says that those days the the you know the feeding practices that first milk baby should get from mother's milk that all that was not uh, appreciated. So I was asked to give the child uh, that uh, powdered milk or cow's milk that affected my child's health and also affected my health. <laughs> So she was uh, saying that how through ignorance uh, her child fell ill, went to hospital, medicines were prescribed and she says her mother bought those medicines because I don't know whether those were uh, you know, medicines which uh, with expiry date or whatever it is, after taking those medicines, my son died. दायित्व तो अपुर माहौलो ऐसे ची संगलो उन्हें रुंडे रुंडे संगल में अपुर वाला का दायित्व जब भी संगल में तैयार किए ची बुकी प्रगाय उनको ना रहना। She says that she 
uh, wanted to commit suicide, but then she has a daughter, so he says, for her sake, I cannot die. And so around that time, the self-help group movement in their village started, and uh, she was selected as the uh, bookkeeper for the group. she says that uh, through the group interventions their livelihoods improved very significantly chitur district is very famous for the daring interventions so they invested in that economically their condition improved and uh, but she also noticed that a lot of expenditure was going for health and uh, around that time uh, the SCRP teams went to their village and said that we want to introduce health interventions and would like somebody to volunteer as a health uh, activist and she volunteered for that and she was selected as a health activist. So she was one of the first things that uh, they were asked to do was to conduct a health survey in the village, go to each household, find out how much they spent on health the previous year and she gave the details including uh, hospitalization, medicines, loss of work. So they did that baseline survey. So she says major items of expenditure on account of uh, diarrhea, the malnutrition related uh, problems of the children, uh, low birth weight children, then uh, mother's health not being well after delivery, abortions, they were sent to Jamkhed. Anybody heard of Jamkhed, Maharashtra? Yeah. So, Dr. Arole, I would say, one of the greatest Indians. He, he has a fantastic health strategy in uh, Jamkhed in Maharashtra. Uh, those from Maharashtra, I would strongly recommend going there and seeing uh, how they do it. Uh, his uh, basic uh, strategy was health awareness, health training for each family. And he picked up Dalit women the most illiterate, the poorest woman as his health activist. So he proved that world class health was possible through the poorest women. So entire serve health training used to happen in Jamkhet. So she says she went there for 45 days. <laughs> So you heard the punch sutra for the self-help groups in the morning. So she says after we came back from training, we introduced 10 points, 10 point agenda for health. 
which each family should uh, practice, which included uh, you know washing hands before uh, eating. It includes uh, consumption of leafy vegetables, not smoking inside the house, uh, latrines, soap pits to see that there is no stagnant water. So about 10 such fundamental points which they would discuss in their group meetings. So she she said around 2006 there was a search within SCRP as to who is the best health activist so that they can get uh, further training. So she was selected as one of the, the best health activists. And she went to Orwakal, where Prajanisa comes from, for training. After that training, I was in the middle of the training. One thing is the R.A.G.I.P.A. agenda, two is the R.A.G.I. Shikshin, three is the R.A.G.I. Podupulu, and I was in the Nutrition Come Day Care Center, and I was in the Samadhi Care Center. So the, their agenda was a five-point agenda. One was, increasing awareness around health, then health risk fund. So health savings and health risk fund. Third was a nutrition come daycare center for uh, taking care of pregnant women and uh, nursing mothers. Uh, so training of each uh, self-help group member on health issues and uh, bringing awareness about health. So health savings, nutrition come daycare centers, training and increasing awareness about health. Convergence. So I said how do you uh, converge with other departments who are working on health and nutrition issues. So that was the first time we actually, earlier it was happening sporadically. Then we decided we have CRP strategy for everything, why not for health? So that's how this health CRP strategy started in December 2006. I went there for their convocation, that was on 1st January 2007 in Achakara. So when all these health activists, this five member team working on health, so what we were doing sporadically got converted into something which we done through CRP strategy. First, we CRP to Kuntur Jilla and Bellamkonda Mandal Vella. After all, we had a lot of nutrition from day care and day care centers. We had a lot of food in the Garbavad, a lot of food in five years, a lot of food in the five years, plus education food in the health education food in the health. So she went for exposure visit to one of the districts in Guntur where this nutrition come day center was functioning for about uh, two to three years prior to this. And she they saw the positive benefits from the nutrition come daycare center. And uh, they started a similar center in the in their village. Uh, NDC Settler Panjas in the Falkanja. NDC So I think this took the, you see earlier health uh, was more related to medicines and uh, 
you know, sanitation related things. But nutrition having a very important role to play in uh, promotive health, so that came to the fore through the nutrition intervention. And uh, she says it's very important for pregnant women and nursing mothers to be very careful about their nutrition. And uh, that was the focus of this intervention. And me, Ramli, friend, you also understand me? Because I am looking at the time also. So, what? डी so she mentioned what should be the uh, the balanced diet for a pregnant woman and nursing mother and that is provided in this uh, nutrition term daycare center so they get three meals hot cooked meals uh, the cook is trained in a home science college and uh, they have uh, leafy vegetables uh this uh, the pulses sprouts adequate quantity of cereals oil seeds and uh, jaggery then function that and ivanni teesukovali plus training kuda sir tv il dwara manaka fiction anedi am em em tablet line enti fiction so it's not just food also a monitoring of the antenatal care the immunization happening properly the डाइट से but also in educational center monitoring the uh, the health of the pregnant women immunization is good or not but so that they may to know any one of them so ensuring immunization easy yes to the end go dpt posted us ante manam anni tikal endu cheyinchukovali anade poorthi kavagaanu garki prathi talli kuda tikal enchukunnaru ante undu kostunnaru so they have ensured uh, complete immunization through this uh, monitoring kalthal uh, chapu प्रति मंडल स्थाई उटे so that the immunization services and the health check up happens on a in a predictable manner so that kind of planning happens in their district itla andaru kalisi cheyadam valla ee roju palitha chuste prathi putni ipu 4000 center lo 4100 center lo ma hyderabad lo unnai ipudu malla kotha center lo vey vey cheyabothunnamo plus ippudi kuda andaru prathi oka pinte kuda 3 kg lu fine ga vurtundi prathi talli kuda yaapi ga undandi very good so what started in 2007 early 2007 there are about 4200 villages where the women are running this nutrition come daycare centers and uh, as a result she says the the child birth weights are now 3 kg and above and uh, the very little mortality uh, 
మీ గ్రామం పరిస్థితి చెప్పండి అప్పుడు మా గ్రామంలో మరణాలు అనేది కలిగింది ఇదైతే ఎప్పుడు పెట్టామో ముప్పై డెలివరీలు అయినా ఇప్పటికి ముప్పై మంది డెలివరీలు ఎవరు కూడా టూ పాయింట్ ఫైవ్ కేజీస్ లో లేరు అంత త్రీ ఫైవ్ లే పుట్టారు మా న్యూట్రిషన్ ఎవరు లేరు కుపోషణ కంటే మేము ఒక్కొక్కటి చేస్తాం ప్రతి నెల గ్రోత్ మాంటరింగ్ అనేది చేస్తాం అంటే తల్లి హండ్రెడ్ వేస్టెడ్ అండర్ వెయిట్ అంటే ప్రతి ఆ మూడి కూడా ప్రతి నెల కొలుస్తాం కాబట్టి బిడ్డను ఆ ఊర్లో మా న్యూట్రిషన్ ఉందా లేదా అనేది తెలిసిపోతుంది so in her own village she says there have been 30 deliveries no case of any malnutrition no child death 3 kgs and above and every month they monitor the health of the children adi sir water sanitation lo kuda diarrhea lo maa gramamlo chaala baadha padaru sir ee roju maa gramamlo water sanitation kuda baa chestunna prathi okaru vyaktigatha marugadanu nirminchukunna andaru vaadutunna diarrhea ane maa gramamlo lekunda chestunna sir ఈ హెల్త్ లోనే చేయాలి సో షీ సేస్ వి హావ్ ఎలిమినేటెడ్ దిస్ కర్చ్ ఆఫ్ డైరియా ఫ్రమ్ అవర్ విలేజ్ एवरीबॉडी హస్ లెటర్స్ దే ఫాలో ఆల్ ది హెల్త్ ప్రాక్టీసెస్ ఇన్ ఫ్యాక్ట్ దే హావ్ వన్ సెవరల్ అవార్డ్స్ షీ హస్ గాన్ టు ఢాకా టు కలెక్ట్ అన్ అవార్డ్ ఇట్ వాస్ ఏ యాజ్ ది బెస్ట్ ప్రాక్టీస్ కేస్ ఇన్ ఎంటైర్ సౌత్ ఏషియా సో దిస్ ఇస్ ఏ ఐ యు నో స్పెండ్ సమ్ టైం ఆన్ దిస్ బికాజ్ health is one of the biggest poverty traps and if we don't have a community based strategy uh, we'll never come out of that so just as it is important to look at enhancing incomes we also have to see whatever you know uh, pulls you down so how do you build this uh, safety net and uh, this is a this is one program which uh during the time i was in serve till 2010 almost on a daily basis i used to monitor this program so something i felt very important for the whole country because if you see our uh, human development indicator of india it's not moved somewhere 139 140 141 or i don't know if it's worse than that uh to a great extent health education uh these indicators have to move and they they are not falling below a certain point in fact my challenge to the health team in andhra pradesh is how do you bring down imr to less than 10 us is 7 per 1000 so so that is the challenge i have given them so i am hopeful with uh, suda and the team they will be able to achieve that thank you so much న్యూట్రిషన్ and we worked out different models in andhra pradesh how to meet this cost but now government has responded and uh, at least 15 to 17 rupees per day comes from government's own intervention where over and above icds they provide uh, two hot meals a day and the the village organization provides the rest much the much sir na bidadu ba uttukunna nen 10 mandi sahay padtaru ani ee roju garavanni feel avutunna sir He says, even though I lost my child, I am very happy that I am helping others to protect their children. That's a fantastic question. Yeah. So what we will do now is break into groups and uh, the... After you. Yeah. Yeah, Vincent will go back. Thank Before I propose a formal vote of thanks, कुछ पंक्तियां सभी विमेन हीरोज के लिए हम लड़ेंगे साथी हम लड़ेंगे उदास मौसम की कसम खाकर हाथ में पड़ी गांठों की कसम खाकर कत्ल हुए जज्बात की कसम खाकर हम लड़ेंगे साथी हम लड़ेंगे कि अब तक हम लड़े क्यों नहीं लड़ते हुए मर जाने वालों की याद जिंदा रखने के लिए हम लड़ेंगे साथी क्योंकि लोग बस गरीबी की बातें करते हैं 
हम लड़ेंगे क्योंकि हमने गरीबी को खाया है I on behalf of the academy faculty and my colleagues would like to extend a heartfelt gratitude to Mr Vijay Kumar Dr Yogita Rana and Mr Manika Raj for taking out time from your busy schedule and addressing us on the livelihood mission and their successes I would also like to thank all the women heroes who came all the way from Bihar MP Jharkhand AP and JNK to share their inspiring life stories मंजिलें उन्हीं को मिलती हैं जिनके सपनों में जान होती है मंजिलें उन्हीं को मिलती हैं जिनके सपनों में जान होती है पंखों से कुछ नहीं होता हौसलों से उड़ान होती है इट वॉज इंडीड अ प्लेजर टू लिसन टू यू एंड आई एम श्योर विल बेनिफिट इमेंसली फ्रॉम योर एक्सपीरियंसिस इन द ईयर्स टू कम आई वुड नाउ लाइक टू कॉल अपॉन माई कोलीग मिस रिजना to present a memento as a token of our appreciation and gratitude to sir mr vijay kumar and mr arvind koswal to dr yogita rana and mr nehal to sir manika rana group a b uh, in sph group group c in gbph and group d in sph yanshila <laughs>